Coach, what did you uh, what did you learn about your team after this road trip? Well, I think you know we, we really had some good second halves. I like the way we competed um, uh, in, the, in, in, in both games. Um, tough teams to prepare for. Uh, really good set offensive teams. So. Um, and I, I thought we got some good play off the bench. I thought some of our freshmen played pretty well. Jeremy Shepard played well uh, both games. I thought Raekwon played very well. Dan Riak is starting to uh, you know, feel more comfortable out on the floor. So those guys, you know, you know, your, your three that you can count on were always there. But uh, I thought Andre Washington really had, you know, I was worried about him back-to-back -back games. Um, and, and at the end of a four-game in one week stretch, but I thought he, he played very aggressive for the weekend. You go three and one, very well could have gone four and zero. Oh. How, how pleased were you with the result of that four games in one week? Well, we're disappointed after the loss to Mercer. I mean, it was a hard, it was a great game, it was a physical game, it was a tough game to the end, and just we really got a bad, bad, bad break at the end. It was, it was bad. Um, I thought it was bad in person and it was bad on tape, so it was confirmed. But uh, and that was disappointing for our guys. And that was really disappointing. But uh, as part of you know, part of basketball, you got to be able to come back from disappointment with not much turnaround and having a tough team like uh, Air Force. Um, and I told people on the radio that uh, Air Force is like getting ready for Navy in football with no days. So I mean, they run the Princeton offense. So we. Um, had a lot to do in a short period of time. So I was proud of our guys responding against the team that their, their system is very, very difficult to prepare, even if you have a, well, two weeks. So um, so that, that was a good sign for us. How important was it to get a win away from Minji? Well, it was. I mean, it's always important to, to win away. You know, it was, uh, um, we played really well, and particularly the second half offensively uh, against the uh, Air Force, so you know it's all you got. You got to win some on the road. We got to be able to play better on the road, play better away from home. So uh, that was a good sign for us. And I thought we get yeah, the second half against Mercer. The first half we looked like we we're in quicksand. The second half we really, I thought, played one of our better halves of basketball. What's, what's the update on Elijah? Still the same. We're still waiting. It's going to be a time frame deal, so you know, we're still a little ways away from him. Do you think uh, there's still something that this team's trying to prove, trying to identify itself? Well, I think, you know, we're trying to get back to figure out, uh, I think, you know, offensively where we can go, how we need to play, um, where the ball needs to go. We're turning the ball over a little bit too much. And, you know, trying to, you know, we got a lot of guys now trying to figure out what the rotations. We really played nine guys double figure minutes. Um, so, you know, we got hopefully Ziggy back and you're going to get Elijah back at some point. So, um, you know, how you utilize that. And I think, you know, our depth um, here has been a factor in the last couple of games. So, uh, I think that uh, we got to continue to, to develop that. You know, get some of the young guys some, some playing time and get them. Get them used to, you know, coming off the bench. Some of these guys have never come off the bench before, so it's different. And they have to be good right away. Um, that's, a, that's a different thing. For them.